Ready. And marker. Hey, no eating on set. I just always get a lot of compliments when I wear this, so I wear it for you guys today. And I'm feeling a little bloated while I eat my uh, Pringles here, but let's put those to the side for now. <clears throat> so, what have I been up to? I am currently in my... So I'm at home in my PJs, lounge clothes, whatever. Kind of just put this on for you guys because I was looking. <laughs> what? What are you looking at me? I was looking crazier earlier. So what have I been doing during this quarantine time? Well, I've been trying a little bit. I'm not even gonna lie, I've barely been trying to do anything y'all. I've tried to do the bare minimum. I've been sleeping in my bed every day. I don't wanna get out of bed. Um, I just get up, I use my phone, um, I watch TV. My days are just full of lazy, 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 lazy. And, um, but I've managed to fit in some things. So let's see what I've been up to during this quarantine season. Yeah? Okay, let's do it. So on one of these days, I made a very sad attempt to uh, have a photo shoot at the park. I was trying to do this. I figured I'm here, I can make some content, you know, I can post some pictures. Show them how I go down the ramp. What ramp? That ramp. Where? From there. A good vlog or video I feel like you must plan out what it's supposed to look like ahead of time don't try to just film footage and slap it all together because it's almost impossible to be creative when you pull something off the top of your head <laughs> so, you know when you want to have like a simple day outside but too many things are with you outside like having camera equipment and your dog and just like bringing your siblings outside like it's just extra work what? Why are you staring at me? And then they stare at you. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Bye. Right along. But, um, no. I had a horrible time. <laughs> I tried to ride a skateboard. Bring my sister to ride her bike and walk my dog at the same time. <laughs> then, um, what else did I do? Oh, I even attempted to go to school and study. Even though I kind of knew my school was closed, I just had a slither of hope that the lounge would be open for like a maximum of 10 people to gather together. Um, but I was very wrong, so yeah. This is 23rd Street. Manhattan and this street is never this empty. So turns out my school is closed, which I should have known. I should have known that, but um, I thought at least the lounges would be open. Um, there wasn't. Everywhere I go, somebody has a face mask on. People are driving around in their face masks. Then, you know, I decided I needed a new amount of space to film. I needed to feel inspired again, and I was like, this isn't it. The way my bed was positioned was cute for just coming in my room and going to sleep, but I knew I needed my room to be my content area because whenever I make content, I have to have a space for my content. I really cannot do it if I don't have, like, I, it has to be clear. So I had to change some things around, and I created some content making space that I'm going to work on some more, but at least it's space. So I cleaned up and I put some things away and 
yeah, this is what it looks like now. Then after that, um, this actually might have been before that. Either way, the same morning, <laughs> me and my little sister decided to work out. This little girl dragged me out the bed, literally dragged me out the bed, like wouldn't leave me alone. And I figured, let me not, I'm putting more work in trying to fight her off, let me just work out with her. So she wanted to do a TikTok dance. I said, the only way I'm doing a TikTok dance with you is if I learn the JLo Super Bowl challenge which I didn't, but when I do, you guys will see that. <laughs> um, so I got up and I tried to learn it. The first few steps are like this, and then he does like something else after that. I don't know. This is a very failed attempt to work out. We worked out for about five to eight minutes. So that's where we are today and now i am here i feel inspired i'm feeling a little uplifted i feel good i finally have my what's gonna be my um my peaceful corner i'm gonna turn it into my peaceful corner where i go to just revive come back to life get some inspo you know re-energize i want this to be my sacred corner um so that's what I'm turning that into. It feels good to have less clutter. Sometimes when you remove stuff, you make space for new things. You literally have to remove things to say, I have space for this. So yeah, that's what that's turning into. But um, it's getting dark and I'm losing light. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you on the next quarantine episode. Bye-bye now.